I feel like I'm gonna, sure. I can't smile any bigger. Um, what is my name, he says. My name is Deanna Hearn. And I'm DeAndre Hearn. And um, I am just so grateful for um, all that God has done through this um, workshop. Um, it has definitely um, fulfilled my expectations and exceeded my expectations. Um, they asked us the question of like, what do you want to get from this workshop? And one of the things is, um, God has been like really um, raising us up in our ministry, at our church and in our business. And it's like, Lord, we want to make sure that we have a foundation in our marriage and our family um, to really steward all the things that you are entrusting us with. And oneness was just so important to me. Like, Lord, I really want to be one with my husband and I wanted to make sure that I was breaking through and breaking free and he was breaking free so that we can um, come from a real authentic place of connection together um, as we walk in the things of God with joy and with freedom. And I really wanted that. And um, we were told about this workshop and we signed up. And I just tell you, um, that we have that, like I feel <laughs> like, I really feel like we are one and we, it was like we just needed something to push us to that other side. Like we have been doing work um, together. We're first generation in a lot of different ways. Like we've been trailblazing a path in our families and we've been married um, together since high school. And um, God has just done some miracles in our lives. But anyways, my husband said, watch the time because I can go on and on. <laughs> But um, we have the tools, and I feel so empowered. We love Jesus, but we have the tools, like the skadooing. <laughs> we didn't know what skadooing was, and now we know what skadooing is, and we know how to invite the Holy Spirit into our intimacy. And it's like all the things that you know are there, but you don't have language for, you don't have verbiage, you don't have the specifics for. We gained it through this workshop, and we just bless Lori and Barry B. <laughs> That's what Lori Kosler has been. And so we're just so grateful. And um, I was able to break through shame that was on my life that I did not realize that um, really affected me as a mom. And now I have breakthrough to where I can, that freedom, my kids will, I'll go home and I can't wait to just love them from a place of freedom and, um, and trust my husband even more. So I'm just... I am so full of joy right now. So I'm just really grateful. All right, I don't know if I can top that, but um, I, I will just be honest. My expectations, um, they probably weren't the highest. Um, I don't mind going to things that will help our marriage but I had the expectation of, is this another touchy-feely <laughs> conference and maybe they'll give me a tool or two to take back and try to implement. Um, but going through it and being with our group, um, mm. this actually empowered on a whole nother level yes. that didn't just focus on the marriage, but the individual and the deliverance and how things and traumas from the past will try to creep in and affect the marriage. So um, what I received was something on an intimate individual level that I see that I can carry forward as I come together with my wife because we're one and uh, we could be um, as one together and move forward in a synchronous way. Uh, so what my breakthrough is really the um, intimacy that we were able to experience, but for me, that uh, physical affection, which I did not grow up in an affectionate environment. It really wasn't displayed physically, and I had a difficult time, even though I would try to display it to my wife and my daughters, and I'm a girl dad, so I know how important it is to be able to show physical affection and for them to be able to see healthy physical affection. So um, I had my breakthrough. Yeah.